It's red carpet time, and our star Billy is about to make his grand entrance. Transforming this underwhelming box into a romantic Hollywood-inspired hideaway has been a delicate exercise of fusing the celebrity hip boutique style from the Lux Hotel with an established sense of old Hollywood that's still timeless and classic. Okay, Billy, it's time for you to see your new suite. <laughs> hey, this is like a hotel suite. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna like come home from work every day to go to vacation. It's, it's amazing. What we tried to do is we tried to take the attitude, that sort of hip Hollywood attitude of the Lux Hotel, and combine it with that sort of old Hollywood style that you really liked. We merged those two concepts together to give you a look that we felt completely suited you. Well, you did a great job. I mean, it's, it's perfect. The first thing you see, obviously, when you walk into the space is the bed. Now, remember, you had it pushed over in the corner, <laughs> yes. which sort of says, I want to be alone for the rest of my life. <laughs> oh, all right. All okay. Right, all right, all right. Now, of course, it's in the center of the room. It is the focal point. What women love is the idea of seeing luxury, and part of luxury for them is beautiful fabrics. But we've tried to keep them tailored enough for you so that it's all done in solids. A little bit of shimmer. If that's too much pillow for you, 86 those three. <laughs> when she comes over though, <laughs> stick them on there right, immediately. Right. <laughs> okay. Now, what are you thinking about the color in the room? I think it's good. Yeah, I like the color. I mean, I've always liked greens anyway, but you get the greens and the slates and the black and well, you they had all work the, well. You had initially, you had the sort of emerald green color. Mm -hmm. We wanted to kick that up a notch, make it a little bit more contemporary. So we took that, made it a little bit more um, organic feeling. So it's more of a slate green gray. The other thing that we tried to do, I know that you had an issue with the windows. Now the windows, basically, we've dressed, in order to make these windows all appear to be in balance with the space, we've actually hung the rod way up to the ceiling, draped the entire thing, but then brought it around, so that covers the, the window there, but then we brought it around here too. Mm -hmm. So you've got symmetry on both sides, all right? Just going to show you that it almost feels like there's another window here as well. Yeah, no, definitely. The other thing that was a big issue was the lamp issue. You didn't have a lot of lighting in here, you <laughs> as remember? In as as yeah. in none. Now you were, I will say, you were challenged for places to plug in. But the one thing that the bed saved us for is we were able to hide everything under the bed. So all the cords are under there, but you've got complete symmetry on this side and on that side. Here again, we were trying to keep it, you know, that deco kind of feeling that you like, sure. but a modern deco. And the, by the use of the, the, the various metals, we felt that was a little bit more masculine with the black shades versus white shades that are in the hotel. I love this little seating area because it, it divides the room, it gives the room something else. And you know, before I just, like we talked about, I would come home from work, I go to right. bed, I wake up at five, I leave, I didn't do anything else in here. Yeah. Hence no lights, no anything. <laughs> right. <laughs> now, you know, I, it's almost like two rooms and it's like a hotel suite. That's exactly right. I mean, this is a place that allows you to do something else in the room besides just sleep here. That piece right there, actually, when you open it up, it morphs into a complete pull-out laptop mm -hmm. station, complete with cord management and everything. Now, based on that old Hollywood idea, look what we did with the photograph. This is amazing. It's beautiful. It's, I think it gives, I think it gives him his due justice. It's sort of an homage. There's a little bit with the candles going. But what we did initially was we wanted to figure out how to get this in this space and make it have real prominence. So the idea here is we took it, mounted it in an existing mirror, and then repainted portions of the mirror to match the room. So now it's a big installation. So hopefully this will be a good lifestyle upgrade for you. And hopefully everything that you see here can easily translate through the rest of your house. So, you know, from the front door all the way up here, you'll have a very sort of seamless adult space that you can be proud of. Definitely.